Welcome to Intersex Tutorial Part 1. In this tutorial I'm gonna show you guys how to create a mass, sort of this irregular shape, how to divide the surface of that mass and sort of create this irregular pattern. And then in parts 2 and 3 I'm gonna create the solid panel and then the window panel that's gonna imitate what this picture shows. So let's open up Revit 2011 and uh, open up new conceptual mass. And I'm just gonna make it. I'm just gonna make something quick. Uh, so let's click model rectangle set. Pick the level one. Just draw a box on it. Create form. Just drag this thing out. Select the corner point. Drag the point out. Up a little bit. just so it somehow resembles what this thing is. So let's drag this thing out, down a little bit, this one maybe up a little bit. It's not important, it's exactly the same. Okay, uh, next step is to select the surface. I'm going to show you how to do just one of those. It's going to be quicker and divide that surface instead of uh, to make sure that the layout is a fixed number and for both of those U and V grids let's put one in. Okay next step is to create uh, reference planes that are going to be the actual pattern on the kernel wall. So let's set and let's draw them up on this vertical level. So let's just draw a couple of those lines. Okay, so we have that. I'll select the, the surface again. Hit intersect. Hold down control key. Select all the references, reference planes that we just cre created and hit finish. What that gives us, it actually creates, you can isolate it, it's gonna, you can see better. It creates that, sort in the points at which uh, intersects the plane, it sort of creates a panel out of it. So here it is the, the wall that we wanted to create. Um, in the next part I'm gonna show you how to create the solid panel and part three I'm gonna show you how to create the window.